Hi everyone, welcome to my kitchen. In this recipe, I'm going to show you how to make a basil pesto. Basil pesto is nothing but a um, chutney that is made from fresh basil leaves and then ground along with some nut garlic and a little bit of spices. So without wasting any time, let me just dive right in and show you how to make a basil pesto. So to begin making the basil pesto, there are a couple of ingredients that you need. Uh, I have some fresh basil leaves over here. I also have some walnuts, some olive oil, garlic, red chili powder, cumin powder and salt and just a little bit of water as well. So I'm just going to go ahead and put all of these into my mixer grinder and then blend it to make a nice chutney, also known as the basil pesto. This is very home style and it's really fresh and delicious and has just the right amount of olive oil and flavoring and ingredients and taste. And to this, you can also squeeze in some lemon juice to give it an additional zing and yang. So let me just put everything together in the blender and show you how to make the pesto. So to begin making the pesto into my blender jar, I'm just going to go ahead and add in my basil leaves. To this some walnuts, some garlic cloves, I'm going to add in some olive oil, salt to taste, just a dash of chili powder and some cumin powder which is roasted. I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of water and then blend it to make a nice smooth chutney or the pesto. And doesn't that look beautiful? Perfect pesto which is well blended into a nice smooth puree and I'm just going to go ahead and transfer this to a bowl and um, the pesto is ready. So I hope you enjoyed watching the recipe of how to make a basil pesto. It's really simple to make and there are multiple uses to it. You can use it as a spread over uh, a sandwich or you can toss it up in a cooked pasta and make a spaghetti pesto pasta. Add in some olives as well into it and uh, it'll be really nice and you, in fact you can add in some cream as well to the pasta and make it a really nice creamy delicious basil pesto pasta. Um, and what else? You can put it in wraps, uh, you can put it in sandwiches as I told you and um, yeah, um, uh, multiple different ways. You can even toss it along with some uh, rice and make a baked dish or even um, uh, toss it along with some vegetables, uh, roasted vegetables and then make, make a nice baked dish as well. I hope you give this recipe a try and when you do, don't forget to share your feedback in the comments below because I'll always be looking to hear back from you. Don't forget to take a snapshot of it and tag us across all the social channels because I'd love to hear from you. So until then, until next time, happy cooking and healthy eating.